Dolores says holding herself accountable has helped her lose weight in the past. In today's video, I'm gonna discuss one of our very own clients' ways of getting to the weight loss goal that she's looking for, and also what has created problems for her in the past. Now, Dolores says that she holds herself accountable and this has helped her big time lose weight in the past. And so my response is that I love the military mindset. I have some clients and I put them in special groups where literally I just tell them what to do and they get it done, right? Now, this is a fun group for me because it's just like, here's the five steps. I know if I say it once, it gets done. Now, Dolores, I know this Dolores, you might not. Dolores is a no excuse is given. And I know Dolores has been through a lot throughout her life and she's a person that's gonna get it done no matter what. If she's gotta hobble in there, if she's gotta you know, do a virtual workout, no matter what it is, she's going to get it done. And that's why Dolores, I think, stays fit year round because you are what you consistently do. If not giving yourself any slack is your method, then honestly, stick with it. Don't let people try and talk you out of it, right? There's gonna be people that says, oh, you can just have one, or oh, why don't you live a little? You gotta remember that this is your style and it's working, so you're going to stick with it. Never mind what all those other people are saying. That might work for them, okay? Hey, that works for you. For me, I'm strict. Accept that you're strict, just like Dolores, get the work done, get the results, create your own self-happiness, and forget about what everybody else is saying. Now on the same side, Dolores says that stress is a problem for her and she stops caring about everything and it makes her fall off her weight loss success journey. So my response is you can only control what you do and, ev and understand that everything else is out of control. You can steer the boat, but the wind dictates the movement. So you can only control how you feel, you can only control your actions, and if other people's actions or other people's responses or their lack of action is affecting you, never mind them. That's their journey, that's where they are in their path. Focus on you and what you can control so that you don't fall off and it brings you down a negative spiral. So what would I tell you? is to take the stresses that are holding in your head and I want you to start journaling them, okay? I want you to break your stresses down into small components. Then develop an action plan with timelines and lastly, you gotta implement them. So once again, journal the stress. If it's a stress, spouse. Break it down to pisses me off, doesn't pick up his own socks, uh, lazy, doesn't get up <laughs> early enough. Put all those things down, and then under each one of them, you're gonna have an action plan. Okay, so he doesn't pick his socks up, so I'm gonna start putting his socks all in his shoes. <laughs> I'm just kidding, do whatever you want, but that could be one. So there's, there's the step, and then once you get those steps in, you start implementing them, okay? So deal with your stress, figure out your stresses, break it down to small components, have a couple action plans, and then most importantly, implement them. Remember that only you can control what you do and everything else and everybody else is out of your control. You can steer the boat, but the wind dictates the movement. So focus on what you can control and let go of what you can't. Now I wanna thank you for this video. I wanna thank everybody that's been contributing to these videos. You're giving me great content. I'm very passionate about helping people. I'm very passionate about getting weight loss success. And more importantly, I wanna know what falls off. So I wanna thank everybody that contributed to these videos. And I hope you found my tips helpful because if you did, please give the video a like, throw a comment in this comment section to help with the algorithm. And I want you to stay tuned for the next video where we're gonna discuss how to make this your fittest year yet.